factors. In order to find factors, uh, we have to understand what they are. So, let's just talk about um, a number 36. Okay? And I want to find 36's factors. All of the factors that make up for 36. Okay? And <clears throat> uh, factors are always sets of pairs. Okay? There's always two factors to every uh, um, number. And every number has at least two factors. And the numbers that have only two factors are called primes. So let's look at a prime number really quick and understand what a factor is. A factor is, is, a, a, is, uh, is a part of a number that you use in order to create the number. Okay, so you, you can use two pairs of numbers, okay? So in this case, we'll start with 1 and 5. So 1 times 5 is 5. So those are two factors of 5. So they, they, are, they are two numbers that multiply in order to get the original number, okay? So are there any other number, any other factors of 5? No. And so this number only has two factors and it's called a prime number. A prime number with two factors, that's it. Okay? So when we look at 36, we want to look at what numbers multiply to be 36. So we always start with the low number. So We'll start with 1, and what number times 1 is 36? And so we should be able to come up with 36, okay? And now we say, is 36 divisible by 2? Yes. Okay? So then, how many, what, 2 times what is 36? 13. Close. I heard 13, but 18, right? Because we forgot there's a 3 there, right? 3 and 3 is 6. But that comes back to that whole, you know, we multiply two things, two 3s to get the, the 6. But we forgot that two, two ones make a 2, and we had to add up another 10 in there. And that came from two other 5s. So we really had 13 plus 5, which is 18. Okay? Why did I say 13? Yeah, it's okay. Alright, so does 3 go into 36? Yeah. Okay, how many times? So 3 goes into 3 once, and 3 goes into 6 twice. Does 4 go into 36? How many times? Nine times. Okay. Does five go into thirty-six? Does six go into thirty-six? How many times? Six. Six times. Now, this is one of the very, very few <coughs> problems that has an odd number of factors. And the only reason it has an odd number of factors is because it's a perfect square. Okay? Because this is a perfect square, you can't bring a 6 in twice. Right? And as soon as you start saying the same number again, right? In other words, does 9 go into 36? Yeah, 4 times. See how I'm saying the same things again? Yeah. It doesn't count as, as separate factors. Okay, so this six is not part of the of what factors make up for thirty six. Thirty six factors are one, two, three, four, six, nine, twelve, eighteen, and thirty six. Okay. Okay. So, when do you know when to stop? When to stop counting? And that is 
when you get to a point where your numbers start to repeat themselves. When, you, when your numbers start to repeat themselves, you know to stop. You're done figuring out the factors. Okay?